Hey guys, this is Jessica Richardson with Twofold Marketing and I have a Q&A today. We get this question a lot is if I have a new website, do I use Google Sites, do I use WordPress or do I use Wix? It's a really great question and I'm going to jump right in. I'll give you my answer for my personal preference at the end of the video. So let's go. Google Sites, let's talk about the pros and cons. So one of the pros of using Google Sites is that whenever you put content onto a Google site, you don't have to wait for the spiders or the Google bots to crawl your site so that it knows that new content is on your site. It's instant, it's already there. But some of the cons is that there's not a whole lot in terms of customized looks and aesthetic appeal, but maybe as Google Sites grows, if it does, there will be more in terms of customized options. One thing that we're not sure yet is, you know, Google Sites is a Google product and Google tends to push its products up to the top. There's not a whole lot of research done yet on whether Google Sites has that benefit. So for now, I think I would personally wait until there's more research done on Google Sites before you decide to either transfer your entire website to it or use Google Sites to make a new website. Moving on, so Wix websites. Wix websites are interesting. Back before 2016, there was a lot of negativity surrounding Wix because Wix didn't allow you a lot of ability to do SEO. In 2016 though, they made a lot of changes that made basic SEO a possibility. And so for regular websites that aren't super competitive, it's an okay option, it's not my favorite. It's really not for more competitive avenues like insurance, attorneys, real estate, dentists, medical professionals, definitely not for those. Now we go into my personal favorite, which is WordPress. I would recommend WordPress. It is harder to navigate WordPress if you're a new user, uh, but there's so much more capability with WordPress. There's so many add-ons and themes and plugins that just make SEO for an SEO expert a whole lot easier. There's a lot of reporting tools that you can use with it. I think if you're looking for a beautiful custom website that is good for uh, competitive fields, that would be the way I would go. And Google still likes WordPress a lot. So that's the direction that I would recommend. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, please subscribe to our YouTube channel and I will see you tomorrow.